The Cavern Park Zoo could be showcasing a new penguin exhibit if voters approve a $14.5 million bond. This after county commissioners voted last night to approve the ballot proposition on the election in November. Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza, she's live at the zoo tonight with more on the proposed bond and what it means for taxpayers. How's it going? 1,600 animals, just like this girl Aurora, who's an animal ambassador for the education program. If the bond is approved, the zoo hopes the exhibit or the zoo hopes the expansion will bring more people in. But there is opposition. You never know till you try. Yeah. You know, build it and they will come. So, <laughs> 14 and a half million dollars to expand and renovate this 26-year-old staple in McLennan County. To expand on our education programming, our veterinary services, and add one of the coolest exhibits in the United States, the South African penguins. Black-footed penguins are currently endangered, and the zoo hopes to house them in what they call the Penguin Shores Habitat. Interim Zoo Director Johnny Binder says animals need these types of sanctuaries to survive. Fifty years ago, there were over 140,000 pairs of African penguins. Now that's down to 20,000 pairs. Zoo guests say a new exhibit is just what the 52-acre lot needs. I think that would be really cool because they already have like an otter slide. They already got all sorts of other cool exhibits. I think a penguin one would sit suit it nicely. <laughs> But two Facebook pages, the McLennan County residents opposed to Zoo Bond, and the Cameron Park Zoo wants to steal your money. Call the zoo a money pit that loses money every year. They want residents to vote no on every bond. The younger crowd that are old enough to vote probably wouldn't vote for it. But I would say, you know, young families and even uh, grandparents like myself yeah, yeah. would probably <laughs> vote for it. As for taxpayers, the zoo says the bond is tax neutral, which means it will not impact your property taxes. I believe our citizens will really support it. We have a lot of folks out in the county that love their zoo. Just under three months on November 5th. Live at Cameron Park Zoo, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.